been told to us, and Jared Holbrook reported earlier, that potentially the suspect was hiding in that boat under one of those canopies you put on to okay. winterize okay. your boat. And perhaps he was hiding in there. So they're going to take this very carefully, one step at a time. Shepard Smith in Boston Whether now. And here's what we believe has happened from the best of the reporting at this moment. Uh, 15, 20 minutes ago, as it's been described to us, a woman calls the police there and says, they checked my boat, but now the door's open and there's blood there. The police go out, find it. At some point, their shots begin to fire. According to witnesses, some 30 shots fired. In fact, hearing it all on scene is our producer, Chris Leibel, who's live on the live line with us now. Chris, I guess this was, what, 10, 15 minutes ago? Tell us how it started. Yeah, Shepard, it was about 15 minutes ago. It was right after the press conference uh, ended, um, allowing people to, to get outdoors again. The ban was lifted on uh, people having to stay indoors. I was talking to a few neighbors. I was just actually doing an interview with one of them about what it was like being indoors for the last uh, 24 hours or so when we heard probably about 10 to 20, if not more, gunshots go off. We stopped. We ran over here. We saw police flooding the scene, a lot of movement. We've seen a constant stream of uh, police cars with their sirens on rushing towards uh, what would appear to be the site. It's about a mile west of us. Um, we're kind of being held in place right now. We can't go anywhere. We're on lockdown. But... Uh, yeah, it was it was pretty intense there.